Hey guys, so today I'm finally doing my makeup clear out video. I had already filmed it once and was like showing you as I picked through, but that video, literally just the lip drawer, took me like an hour. To, and that's even when I edited it down, it was still like a 45 minute long video. And let's be honest, nobody wants to watch 45 minutes of me picking through my lipsticks. So, what I decided to do is I have my bag of stuff I'm getting rid of. It's in the Lush bag. I work there, so I ended up getting, going home with a lot of Lush bags. Um, and it's sturdy. And so that's going to have all the stuff I'm giving away to somebody else. I also have a few things I'm just going to throw away because they're old and they're kind of gross. So I'm going to go ahead and start with ones I'm just going to throw out completely. So first off, I have a lipstick from L'Oreal. It's ancient. My older sister gave it to me. It's in Really Rose. It smells like roses. It's a pretty color. It's shimmery though, and I don't know how old this thing is, so I'm throwing it away. Next, I have another thing my older sister gave me at one point. This is NYC... I think it says Lip Plumper, but it's hard to read. And it's in Pink Champagne. It, I, I, again, I don't know how old this is, so I'm just going to go ahead and toss it. Uh, next, I have a lipstick from Ulta. This was in a little set thing that I got from my mom when we moved. I don't know how old this is. It smells weird, so I'm going to go ahead and toss it out. It, this one is in sheer berry, but yeah, tossing it out. Another L'Oreal thing. This is a double-ended, like, volume perfect. It has on one end, like, a primer, and then the other end is the color, which is in 120. I don't see any other names on there, so. It's a really light, kind of frosty, shimmery pink. Again, I just don't know how old it is, so I'm going to go ahead and toss it. The last two things I'm just for sh I'm just throwing out is this NYC lipstick in Air Kiss. This one I actually bought myself, but I've had it forever. It's really, really beat up. I mean, can you see that? Just look how it, it looks really beat up. And honestly, I don't like the color anymore. It's shimmery. So I'm just going to toss it. I don't want to give something that beat up to anybody else. And it's got to be like four or five years old. And finally, the last one I'm throwing away is an, it's another Ulta lipstick in Iced Cappuccino. For one, the color looks terrible on me, and for two, it's from the same set as the other one, so it's just as old. So that's the stuff I'm throwing away. Not that much to actually get tossed out, but a lot of this is actually still in decent shape. It's just stuff I don't use often enough to justify holding onto it, or I have something else that I like more in like the same color. So, giant bag of stuff, I'll give you kind of a peek inside. I don't know if you'll be able to see. You can see my bag of stuff that I'm getting rid of. It's fairly full. So I'm just going to kind of grab stuff and tell you why I'm getting rid of it. I'll try and keep it short though. I don't want this video to be 45 minutes long. So, so the first thing I grabbed is, I've out of the bag is a Emil London Show Off Lip Lacquer in uh, Big Bang. It's the red. These are nice. There's nothing super wrong with them. I don't think I've ever actually worn this, and if I did, it was like once. So I'm going to see if somebody else wants it, because literally I pretty much just swatched it, so it's not going to be that bad. But I've never really worn it. The formula doesn't set very well, so it ends up smudging and you have to babysit it. So I'm, I think I'm getting rid of, like, all of these that I have, but I could be wrong. Am I, if I am holding on to any, it's because I really love the color. So I'm getting rid of this guy. Next thing I grabbed is a CoverGirl Jumbo Gloss Balm. I don't remember what this one is called because it doesn't actually have the color name on here. I know I looked it up at one point, but it's a kind of berry color. It's one of the twist up pencils. I haven't, I wore this last fall, but I haven't worn it since. I haven't really, I've only worn it a little bit and I have better berry colors, so I'm just going to get rid of this guy. Next, I have a Ulta Lip Crayon in Doll Face. I don't think I've ever worn this. My mom gave it to me. She's wore, she wore it like twice. I'm just not going to wear it. I don't love the color. All right, so now I have the L'Oreal, um, those gloss balm stain, or the gloss stain things. This one's in the red shade. I don't remember what it's called. It's the sticker pulled off. I used to love this. Um, I did wear it a lot, so I really should be throwing this one away, but I'm going to see if anybody I know wants it, and it's cool with it having been worn, because I mostly I don't wear them because of the smell, because I had a couple, like two or three. I think I'm getting rid of all of them. Yes, I'm also getting rid of the coral one. I feel like I have one more that isn't pink. Yeah. And this pink one, which also the name is gone. So I'm getting rid of all three of these that I owned. I just don't like them that much. I never wore or only wore like once or twice these two. And I wore this one a lot, so I may just toss the red one, but these two will probably go to somebody. 
All right, so now I've got a few Maybelline lipsticks I'm getting rid of. Oh my goodness. I did not organize ahead of time and I apologize. It, they just got tossed into a bag and I got rid of them as I saw fit. All right, so I've got five Maybelline lipsticks I'm getting rid of um, for various reasons. These I can sanitize, so I'm gonna go ahead and give them to somebody. So I am getting rid of two in purple packaging. These ones, at least as far as I can tell, are have been at least standard collection. The first one is Plum Perfect. I just, this color is not flattering on me. It's too brown, so I'm going to give that to somebody else. And it's the same deal with Mauvelicious. It's just too brown on my skin and too dark. It's just not flattering. I did give these a try right before I decided to toss them. Then I have two of the Vivids. Both of them are standard collection ones. I'm getting rid of Vibrant Mandarin because I literally just never wear it and I don't need a neon orange lipstick, really. Orange looks terrible on me. I'm also getting rid of Shocking Coral. I've worn it like twice. It's just not a color I find flattering on me. So why hold on to it, right? And I'm sure somebody I know will like them. And the last one I'm getting rid of is in Very Cherry. This one actually used to be one of my absolute favorite reds. Thing is, I have way more red lipsticks that I love now, so why hold on to this one? I have a ton of reds, keeping most of my reds. And I found that I either like a really glossy finish or a matte finish with my red lipsticks. And this is a cream finish, so it just doesn't suit me. Here, one I am keeping, but the, like pretty much has replaced that one for me as my ideal red, is... Um, NYX Matte Lipstick in Eden. This is like my favorite red. So since I have this, I don't need that. All right, next, I'm getting rid of my three uh, Juice Beauty Reflecting Lip Glosses in their old formula. They reformulated and I didn't know it. And I got one of the new formulas in an Ipsy bag, loved it. It's my, like one of my favorite lip glosses. So then we went online and I bought and got these three but they're the old formula and they're just not as good. And now I have the new formula that's way better in the same shades, so I'm just getting rid of these. And I think I wore them like once, because like I swatched them and wore one like once. All right, so here's something I'm getting rid of. This is the Essence Stay Matte Lip Cream. Uh, what shade are you in? in Velvet Rose. It's kind of a neutrally pink, but whenever I wear it, I've worn it, I think, once. It's just not flattering on me, so I'm going to give it to somebody else. Got a few of the same formula again, so I may as well show you all in one go. Here are the rest of the Apocalypse Show Off Lip Lacquers I'm getting rid of. I literally think I've never worn any of these, so these ones are going to somebody else. I've got a L'Oreal Lake Gloss in short shorts. It's this purple color. It's pretty much clear, and I have a more clear lip gloss that I like better, so I'm just going to get rid of this guy and give it to somebody who wants it. I have one, just the one. Else. I have two e.l.f. Super Glossy Lip Shines that I got from a holiday set. I just don't like this formula. It's They each smell we kind of weird, so I'm just going to get rid of them. I can afford Somebody might like them, and if they don't, I'll throw them out. I found another Maybelline lipstick I'm getting rid of. This one is in Coral Crush. I just don't, I have better corals. I don't like this color that much. I used to love it. I don't have any more. It looks kind of old lady coral on me. I've got an Ulta Lip Stain, an Extreme Wear Lip Stain. I don't know what the shade is in. It's shade number 11. I don't even know if they still make this. I've never worn it. My mom gave it to me. So I'm just gonna sanitize it and give it to somebody else. Alright, I have a Neutrogena Moisture Smooth Color Stick in Sweet Watermelon. I just don't like these on me. They don't look that great, so... And I don't find them that comfortable, so I have more comfortable lip products that I like better, so I'm just going to give this away. Again, I can sanitize it. more. Alright, I have just one of the, the Revlon Just Bitten Kissable Balm Stains. This is an Adore. I thought it was a pretty red color, but then I got it home and it's this weird kind of coppery color. It's red, but it's got a lot of copper shimmer to it. So I'm going to give that to somebody else because that looks terrible on me. One, two. Three. 
four. I have, it looks like, yeah, four of the Revlon Super Lustrous lipsticks. One of them is matte, three of them in the cream, uh, three of them are in different formulas. I've got two creams, a pearl, and a matte. So the matte is sky pink, and it's just, it doesn't look good on me. It's too weird, like the tone is just not right for my skin tone. I have better pinks, so I don't need that one. Might look good on somebody else. I've also got Va Va Violet. I believe I'm getting, this one's actually really pretty. I think I'm getting rid of it because I have a very, very similar color in a different formula that I like better. So yeah, I'm getting rid of this one because I have one in a different formula that I like the formula better. These smell weird. The other one smells like vanilla. I mean, it was really close. I think one of them's slightly different in color, but not enough for me to keep both. Um, then the pearl finish one I have is in Violet Frenzy. It's just not that, it's too sheer, so it doesn't turn out looking that cool on me, so I'm just gonna go ahead and get rid of it. I'm sure somebody I know will like it. I've also got Fire and Ice. This is a really classic red color, but it is an orangey red, and it looks, just makes my teeth look yellow. Um, and again, I have better reds, so why hold on to one that doesn't look great on me? Let's see. I've got another jumbo pencil. This is a pop, pouty pop crayon in Coral Crush from Pop Beauty. It's a coral color. I think I've worn it like once, so if I'm not really gonna be wearing it, why hold on to it? I'll give it to somebody who wants it. Let's see here. Okay, I've got this lipstick from J Cat's Beauty. It's in Honeycomb, I believe. This color is just really weird and ugly on me. I don't know if it looked, who it would look good on, because it's really orangey, yellowy, I don't know. I, it's just, um, no, looks terrible on me. I don't know, maybe it'll look good on somebody I know. Maybe somebody I know wants to, yeah, needs that kind of color for a mixing color, or I'll throw it out, it's not a big deal. All right, I've got one. It's like just the one. So I have one of the Mega Last lipsticks from Wet n Wild. This is in Mauve Outta Here. This, this color is just not the most flattering. I have a similar color that just is more flattering, so I'm gonna get rid of this guy. I'm also getting rid of another nude lipstick because they look terrible on me. This one is Fergie Daily from the Wet n Wild Fergie line. This one is a really popular shade from the line, but it looks terrible on me. So I'm going to give it to somebody who it might work on. Let's see. I've got a NYX Round lipstick in Hot Melon. Again, that bright orange color. It just it isn't flattering on me. And this one isn't even that opaque. So. I know some people who orange looks amazing on, so I'm sure one of them will love that. And now I've got another lip gloss. This is a wand lip gloss. I probably will actually throw it out, but this is one of the Lip Out Loud Super Shiny Lip Glosses from Jordana. It's just sticky. It's actually a really pretty color. Like, it's pretty much clear, but it's really, like, super, it is really, really glossy. But, and I'll just throw, I'm gonna actually just throw this one away. I've worn it enough that I don't feel comfortable giving it to somebody. Let's see. I've got a couple of CoverGirl lipsticks. I've got Darling, which is a kind of neutral pink color. I have similar enough ones in formulas I like better that are also from cruelty free brands, so I'm going to give this away. And I'm also getting rid of Spellbound. It's a pretty color, but I just don't wear it. I mean, I have Max um, Girl About Town, which is very similar to this, so I don't need both, so I'm going to give this one away. I have this. Zoya Hot Lips Glossy Lip Balm in Maraschino. It's an interesting little applicator, but it's super sheer on. And it has a hard time squeezing out of the tube, too. Like, it looks like it should be pigmented, right? There at the bottom. It's not. Um, so I'm just going to give it to somebody else who maybe they, they like sheer lip glosses. I have enough sheer lip glosses. I've got a mini from Makeup Forever, I believe? Yeah, Makeup Forever. This is in Rouge Artist Natural. It's not a bad color. It actually could be really pretty. But it smells like perfume. And I don't want to put anything that smells like perfume on my face. So I'm going to give this to somebody else. It was from the Sephora birthday kit, so I might not have anybody to take it, but more minis that I have to get rid of. This one is from the latest Ipsy bag, I, or my last month's Ipsy bag. It's from, what are you called? 
Noya, Nuya, in deeply in mauve. I it's I tried it on finally today. It's just too dark for my skin tone. It looks weird. So I know some people with darker skin tones that it might look gorgeous on. It just looks terrible on me. And then the other one is this Sally Girl lip color in electric pink. Looks like it should be nice and pigmented on your lips. It doesn't show up at all. So again, see if somebody wants it. If not, I'll toss it. It was like 99 cents. It's not the end of the world. All right, I've got a Bella Pierre super lip gloss I have never worn. Don't even know where I got it. This is in vanilla pink. It looks like it might be a great like center of the lip highlighting color, but it's just a little too dark on me, but it might look great on some of those people I know with deeper skin tones. I have two lip butters I'm actually getting rid of. I'm getting rid of Berry Smoothie and Strawberry Shortcake. I know these are like holy grail shades for a lot of people. I just don't use them. Strawberry Shortcake is too cool when I have better cool pinks and Berry Smoothie, I don't know, I just don't like it on me. So I'm gonna give them away. I never use them. And since they are much loved colors, I'm sure somebody will enjoy you getting some use out of those guys. So I've got my one Flower Beauty lipstick I've ever owned. This is one of their uh, Kiss Stick Luxury Lip Colors. This is in Tulips to Kiss You. I don't know if it's the shade or the formula, but this looks just really weird on me. It sinks into the lines of my lips, makes me look liney and weird. So I'm going to give this to somebody else because it might work better on somebody else. And if they don't like it, you can, they can toss it too. Almost done. I've got my last few lip glosses. My, I've got a Stila Lip Glaze in Sparkling Grape. I just, this is too sticky and it's not pigmented and I just don't like it. Um, I've got a Wet n Wild Fergie Lip Gloss in Hot Hot Hot. Um, it's a pretty coral color, but it's pretty much clear, so I'm going to give that away. I've got an Ofra Lip, lip Gloss Plumper in Sultry. It's really thick. I've never worn it, so I'm just going to give it to somebody else. If I have worn it, it's like been like once. I also have a Rimmel Stay Glossy in shit color. What do you, what do you call Rimmel Lip Gloss? I don't know what this color is called because I can't find a name on it, but I have, I've had this for a long time. I'm actually going to toss that guy. Don't know how it got mixed in with the stuff I was giving away. And then my last three things I'm getting rid of. I mentioned this in my last video, my NYX review, but I am getting rid of the uh, Extreme Lip Cream because it's just not a good color on me. I'm getting rid of this Baby Lips Electric in something. It's an orange color. Oh, orange, because this way it smells grosses me out. It's actually a pretty color, but I can't handle the smell. And finally, I'm getting rid of yet another red lipstick. This one is 01 from the Kate Moss uh, Rimmel lipstick line. It's just too orange on my skin tone. It's a pretty color. It just doesn't look good on me. So those are all of the lip products I'm getting rid of. I have a couple that I'm going to kind of play around with, and then I'll mention them in my next video of stuff I'm getting rid of. Because my next drawer to clear out is my eyeshadow drawer, like my eye, my trio palette and trios drawer and my foundation. It's kind of a podgepodge drawer. So when I go through that, I, I first want to go through and I'm going to give myself like all of December and the rest of this month to play with strictly Wet n Wild palettes. Because that's most of my collection in there. And then I can decide which ones I want to get rid of. So I hope you guys liked this video. Um, I know it's a little long, but I was getting rid of a lot of stuff. Um, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.